Collaboration has never been easier. With cloud-based documents that can be created, edited, and stored and shared online. There's no risk of accidentally deleting a file, and you can work on the same document at the same time as colleagues, even when they're working from home or overseas. Google Docs is a great solution, so how does it work? Google Docs offers real-time sharing and editing. This gives you and your team the ability to create documents, view any previous changes, and update them online. You can also import and create documents with various fonts and file formats that can be accessed from any computer with an internet connection and web browser. There are multiple editing tools that make Google Docs so user-friendly. Setting up keyboard shortcuts can help streamline your navigation process. To open a list of keyboard shortcuts on Windows, Chrome, or OS, press Ctrl plus forward slash, and to search the menus, press Alt plus forward slash. On a Mac, the list of keyboard shortcuts can be found by typing Command forward slash, and the menu search key is Option forward slash. You can also use the menu access keys. To do this, open any application menu using the keyboard. Then type the underlined letter for the item you'd like to select. For example, to open the Insert menu on a Mac, press Control Option I. To select Image, type the underlined letter I. You can also search within a file using the keyboard shortcut Control F on Windows or Command F on Mac. To find and replace words in a document, spreadsheet, or presentation with Google Docs, Sheets, and Slides, press Ctrl F and type the word you want to find. If you want to replace the word, enter the new word next to Replace With. To see the next time the word is used, click Next, or to go back to the previous word, click Previous. Narrow your search by using Match Case to target only words with the same capitalization. Match using regular expressions or to replace the word every time it's used, click Replace All. In Google Docs, you can also propose changes directly in the document without changing the original text. This is by suggesting an edit and the document owner has the options to approve them. You must have edit or comment access to document the suggested changes. Moving on to spelling and grammar. Online documents have made it so easy to minimize errors making sure you're producing high quality content that you can show colleagues, clients, and customers. You can check your spelling and grammar and either accept or ignore the corrections. Open a document in Google Docs in the top left, click Spell Check. A box will open in the top right corner. To use a suggestion, click Change. To ignore a suggestion, click Ignore. And to accept or ignore all suggestions, click More, Accept All, or Ignore All. Once you have spelling and grammar suggestions turned on, look out for misspelled words, which will be underlined in red, and grammar suggestions are underlined in blue. The tab key is also a shortcut to quickly accept or ignore the corrections. Press to accept the suggestion, right-click the red or blue underline. The Explore feature is great for quick access to Google Drive files related to your document. To add images or info from other documents, or the web, click Explore. At the top, search for a document, presentation, image, chart, or web page. Search results will show in categories. Web offers information from the web related to your document. Images show pictures from the web related to your document. Cloud Search gives you items from Google Drive and Gmail. With a shared document, visibility is important. As long as you have permission to edit the file, you can see all of the changes that have been made to a document. Start by opening the document, spreadsheet or presentation, click File, and then Version History to see any changes that have been made since the doc was created, as well as who's made them. You can share the files and folders that you store in Google Drive with any of your colleagues, but your organization may limit how you can share files with people outside the business. When you share from Google Drive, you can control whether people can edit, comment on, or only view the file. This is done when you select Share, and input the email addresses, and choose the permission settings from the drop-down menu. Gone are the days of storing files on your computer, with cloud-based software offering so much more. So try these simple tips to make sure you're getting the most out of Google Docs.